What's up beautiful people? This is one of the most affordable Maisonette that I've ever showcased on my channel. It costs for only 30,000 Kenya shillings per month. But if you're interested in buying, you can get a unit from as low as 7.5 million paid in installments. Awesome, right? And it's not far from CBD. So do stick around for that. <laughs> but if we are just meeting or maybe this is your first time tuning into my channel, my name is Edna. I go by the name Natural KTD here on YouTube. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Consider subscribing for more. Don't forget to tap the post notification bell to receive notifications every time I upload a video. Without wasting time, let's dive straight into the video. Let's do this. Yeah, I know that. Yeah, I know that. You're the traveling kind. It's a known fact. Yeah, I know that. All right, guys. So here we go. Before we get in and start exploring the house, on your right, we have the laundry area. Mm. Once you've seen all the things, all the places, I hope it means. And entering the space, this is basically the living room area and it's bright and airy. It's very well lit in terms of natural light. Beautiful glossy tiles on the floor that are sort of wood lookish, you know, giving me that wood look tiles vibe. What do you think? Leave a comment. The spaces inside your heart. Straight ahead, we have some sort of under the stairs uh, storage space, um, you know, under the stairs cabinet. Or what do we call this? Leave a comment and let me know. This area is often ineffectively used, uh, but there are uh, loads of innovative ideas of utilizing this space. This is one of them. You create a cabinet uh, for like maybe your cleaning detergents, cupboard or stuff you store right there. Or maybe if you have a pet, you know, I hope I'm making sense. So you just have to be creative and uh, switch it up and get um, extra storage space. Next, the kitchen area, open kitchen, and it's spacious. Look at that. Lots of cabinetry, some sort of kitchen bar area, so you don't need like a dining table. This is perfect. Um, it's bright and airy. Beautifully done tiles on the wall, seamlessly installed. Uh, the kind of glossy and, you know, makes the space look bright and airy. We have granite countertop spaces or worktops, if you like. Just beautiful. In terms of water, this water 24-7, no rationing. I'm loving the locations for the kitchen appliances, you know, the cooker and the fridge. The appliances can fit seamlessly into this kitchen design. It's actually a functional and practical kitchen area for 30,000 Kenya shillings per month. Uh, this is quite impressive, right? Leave a comment and let me know what you think gorgeous right next we take the stairs so that we can explore the second story for the first story it's basically the kitchen area and the living room space uh, second story we have the common washroom and of course the bedrooms let's do this here we are at the entry of the master bedroom it's actually master on suite and look at that it's amply large Beautiful glossy tiles on the floor area that are kind of reflective. That is why this place is super bright and airy because the light bounces around the room. Are you seeing what I'm talking about? <laughs> and we have a large built-in wardrobe unit that is kind of wall-to-wall. Look at that. So impressive. I love this space. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, you're up in space. You're inside the noise. And voila, look at that. His and hers. <laughs> what do you think, guys? It's beautifully done and it's built to fit this space. I really love this built in wardrobe unit. It complements the interior space. Looks really gorgeous. Once you've seen all the things, all the places. Next, we have the combined washroom space. Check this out. Gorgeous. I love the tiles. Um, it's a good size combined washroom space. I'm 
I'm loving the shower head. It has a large coverage span. You know, when you're taking a shower, the water heats right. I love that. <laughs> it's the simple things, you know. Some sort of shower caddy right here for your soap, uh, you know, shower gels and all that. You have your wash basin and of course uh, they've installed a bidet sprayer or bidet sprayer if you like. Perfect for cleaning in and around the toilet area. And of course um, it's awesome for those people who don't like using tissue paper. That is an important, you know, stuff to have in the bathroom. Look at that guys. In terms of space, it's amply large, right? Leave a comment and let me know what you think about this master bedroom that is on suite. Next, we have the common washroom space that is more or less the same as what we've just uh, checked out. It's actually a replica of what we've just checked out. In fact, the only difference is the, the positioning of stuff, like maybe the wash basin or sink area and uh, the toilet area. And of course, the fact that it's kind of narrow, but otherwise, replica of what we've just checked out. This is the second bedroom and it's well lit in terms of natural light, beautiful tiles. We have a built-in wardrobe unit. It's standard. You know that you're the traveling kind. It's a known fact. Yeah, I know that. the third bedroom remember this is a three bedroom maisonette so yeah this is the third bedroom we have a built-in wardrobe unit it's actually a replica of the second bedroom <laughs> We are going to proceed to check out Maisonette number two. I'm going to be showcasing two units and these units are selling out real quick. If interested, plan a site visit and hurry up guys so that you can get yourself a unit. It's quite affordable, 30,000 Kenya shillings per month. And if you want to buy it's from 7.5 million payable in installments, okay? You're gone now, or you're coming back the second unit we have the living room area that is leading us to the kitchen area open kitchen it's actually um, directly opposite the first unit that i showcased let's explore the second story where we have the three bedrooms and of course the common washroom space once you've seen all the things, all the places, I hope it means that you... This is the master bedroom that is en suite. Look at that. Amply large, beautifully done, bright and Come airy. Come home to me once you travel the world, all the spaces inside your heart. I hope I'll be your Right here we have the common washroom space. This is the second bedroom. It's super bright and airy. We have a built-in wardrobe unit. And directly opposite the second bedroom, we have the third bedroom. And look at that. It's beautifully done. I'll be your high when you fall down low. I hope I'll be your end. 
Now, guys, what do you think about this Masonite so far? Would you consider moving into this unit? Would you recommend to a friend? What do you think about the space? What do you think about the master bedroom? What do you think about the tiles in the living room area? What do you think about the kitchen area? Leave a comment and let me know what you think. Uh, if interested, I'm going to tell you more. And uh, yeah, that's basically it in terms of rent per month. You pay 30,000 Kenya shillings per month. A deposit of one month, that's another 30,000 Kenya shillings per month. There's a service charge of 3,000 cash, a lease agreement of 3,500 cash, and a water and electricity deposit of 5,000 Kenya shillings per month. So the total is actually 71,000 Kenya shillings. The first time you're going to be moving, that's what you'll have to part with. And if interested in buying, it's from 7.5 million payable in installments. You'll have to part with, I think, 1 million cash, if I'm not wrong. But you can get all the details if you call the number in the description box down below. So, yeah, that's basically it. If interested, make sure you call that number. Uh, thank you so, so much for tuning in all the way till the very end. Let me catch you later on the next episode. Cheers and bye-bye. Make sure that you are subscribed and like this video. Okay, goodbye.